Smoked sausages are not just for the grill. Yes, they are great just the way they are, but we can bring them up to a different level. With the cold and rainy season coming in, the Pitmaster stew may just be the perfect meal. Good day everyone, and welcome to the Urban Casserole. Here we will be using 4 smoked sausages from the Ilonga Pitmaster. That will be for later, so let us set that aside for now. Chop up 3 medium okras and pre-boil them in 1 liter of water. Separate the okra and keep the water ready for use. Prepare 5 cloves of garlic, which we will coarsely chop. Then we peel off the skin of 3 small red onions and cut them into quarters. Cut 2 fresh bell peppers, any color will do. Remove the seeds and chop them coarsely as well. Lastly, we clean and chop 2 stalks of celery. Heat your smoked sausages on a lightly oiled pan. Our intent here is to get the flavor infused with the rest of the ingredients when we saute. As soon as they start to sear, you can take them out and set them aside again for the second time. Add in the onions and the garlic and then let them simmer until you start to smell the aroma of the pan. When they do, go ahead and just add all the celery and onions. Give it a little stir and have it simmer somewhere between 3 to 5 minutes. If it looks a bit too dry, go ahead and add in a little bit of oil just to keep the moisture up. From here, we have most of the ingredients in, so it is a good time to season or add flavor. We want to keep this simple and low-key, so 2 tablespoons of paprika and a couple of bay leaves will do. Let them all simmer a bit longer in low fire. And while doing that, we now take our sausages into action. Nothing fancy to do but to slice them up into bite-sized pieces. Add them right away to your pan and continue on with low heat. Give it a little mix and pour over the water you used from boiling your okra. If you threw them out already, you can simply use tap water instead. Drop in one chicken bouillon and add the cooked okra. At this point, you may have lost a bit of liquid, so go ahead and use some additional water. Cover and simmer for 5 minutes. Final touches are your salt, pepper, and hot sauce. They are all optional depending on your taste. I personally added a teaspoon of salt and two tablespoons of sriracha to give it a kick. Again, and as always, a quick stir and a few minutes of simmering is required. See for yourself if you are satisfied on how thick the stew is. If you are not, then you may need to add two tablespoons of roux. This is simply a few spoonful of melted butter with flour gradually added in and heated while continuously stirring until it turns brown. The Pitmaster stew is best served hot and paired with some toasted bread on the side. Smoked sausages are expertly prepared by our friends over at the Ilonga Pitmaster. I hope you enjoyed our recipe for today and I would be truly grateful if you subscribe and share this video to your friends. See you next time here at the Urban Casserole.